Um, and Aaron's gonna play for us. Yeah, where are you? There you are. Okay, and anyway, um, how many of you have seen this musical called Avenue Q? Yeah. 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 <laughs> well, there's Nigel and Nigel and yeah. Uh, and, A joke. <laughs> yeah. So uh, Nigel and Alan and maybe one or two of their friends have seen Avenue Q. Anyone up there seen Avenue Q or heard of it? Okay, the gist is, or the summary is, Avenue Q is Sesame Street for adults yeah. in puppet form. So in the show, the puppets get naked on stage, the puppets have sex on stage, and they talk about lots of things that you would never hear a regular human being talk on stage. But, but that's I, not going to happen. Wait, wait, but you might hear it in Malaysian politics. Yeah. <laughs> So, anyone politician here tonight? No? Yeah, right, whatever. So anyway, uh, uh, yeah, so we're going to do a fun song. Um, I'm going to play a character called Rod, and Rod is a Republican, okay? And he's a Republican, and Republicans are supposed to be very, what's the word I will use? He's um, a log cabin Republican. A what? A log a log cabin Republican. I have no idea what that means. Okay, you know in a bit. But I think I know. I think, I think I know what you mean. I know what you mean. Yeah. Okay, got it. Um, so yeah, he's a Republican, and his best friend, they, well, their roommates, uh, is Nikki, played by Nick. Uh, this, this, these two characters are very loosely based on Bert and Ernie from Sesame Street. <laughs> yeah. Uh, think a little bit, and you'll get it. Okay. So we're gonna do this fun song, and. If you like the song, come and see our show because we do lots of crazy stuff. And there's Nick, Aaron, and me, and then we've got Will on stage. It's a riot, and it's uh, someone took off. It. Yeah, Will took off his clothes, and it was, it was a scandal. But it was fun. Yeah. So um, this is a song that they sing in the show. So Avenue Q. And I play a very interesting character. <laughs> <laughs> An afternoon alone with my favorite book, Broadway musicals. No roommate to bother me. How could life get any better than this? <coughs> hey, Rod! Hey, hi, Stop. Nikki. You have no idea what happened to me at the subway this morning. There was this guy who was smiling at me, laughing at me. No, no, not laughing at me, laughing with me. I think, right, he was trying to hit on me. That's very interesting. Uh, and uh, why are you telling me this? I mean, why should I care? How should I care? Mm, why should you tell me? Mm, what do you have on lunch today? <laughs> you don't have to get all defensive about it, Ron. I'm I mean, not getting defensive. Why don't you care about some gay guy you met, okay? I am trying to read. But I just feel like it's something that we should be able to talk about. We're roommates, man. I don't want to talk about it, Nikki. This conversation is over. But, but Ron! Over! <laughs> okay, so you know, if you were gay, I'll say it's okay. I mean, cause hey, I like you anyway. Because you see, if it were me, I will feel free to say that I was gay. If I'm not gay, Nikki. Eh? <laughs> Leave me alone. I am trying to read. I am trying to read. <laughs> what is that? What? Musical theater? Them gay right? <laughs> what? What? If you were queer, year after year, I'll still be here. Because you're dear to me, huh? and I know that you what would send me to I would if I told you today. Hey, guess what? I'm gay, but I'm not gay. <laughs> I'm happy just being with you. Cause I got so what should it matter to me? What you do in bed?
you like this, come check out All Milk Every three, three gay guys, one straight guy. Never know, maybe by that time, four gay guys. Oh. By the way, my mom and dad's here. Nixon oh. the closet, by the way. <laughs>